A very good evening, respected Tamina Handwala, Chairperson Flow Mumbai Chapter, Niti Goel, other dignitaries and members, Vishwasji. Friends, it's indeed a great evening and I can feel the vibrancy of women power here today at this Trailblazers Award ceremony. In fact, Fiki has always been in the forefront of bringing to light women with their talents, their expertise, with their know-hows and getting them into the main flow of our economy. Fiki has always participated in nation building, nation building by influencing policies, by participating in various dialogues with policy makers and also bringing to light the concerns of the society. In fact, FIKI is an organization with a voice and any organization, especially women, are considered powerful when they have a voice. So I am proud that I am amongst like-minded women who have a voice of their own. In fact, there is a big difference in honoring women or awarding women. When you award or honor women, it means that you are honoring women who have supported her and been by her side. And also when a woman stands up for herself, it means she is standing up for the whole community of women who need support. So it's a great ceremony wherein we are um, celebrating the achievements of women who have taken up challenges and who have known that just hanging on will take them to their goals and how. We would definitely see various examples where women have excelled in their various areas of expertise. But one place at one end where we call women as Devi or we uh, even we call our country as Bharat Mata but at the other end if we look at the uh, situation of women, at times it is alarming and it is not uh, come up to the mark as expected compared to international standards. Just let me give you uh, some statistics. In organized labor forces, women account for 23% in India. In India, formal manufacturing industry, women workers employed account to 90.7%. Only 12% of Indian police are women. So I was sitting there and uh, you are at a great position to influence that. But uh, women in higher ranks in police, they account to 8.7%. And it is everywhere, you look everywhere. It's a um, matter of which needs to be thought on where we need solutions on it. And solutions which are doable and considering that we all come from different environments and conditions. Even in uh, startups which turn into unicorns, the participation of women here is just 10%. So everywhere it has been alarming and we need to work on it. And how do we work on it? We need to look into equity. What is equity? Equity is a way to reach equality. It's a means to reach equality, what we aspire for. And uh, how do we differentiate between the two? Equity, I think so, equality is something in which you give shoes to the needy. That makes them equal in terms of opportunities. But equity is giving shoes of their own size to people. So it's important that you see what is the requirement and it needs to be tailor-made. Like in the police, you, you have so many issues with women. A uh, few days back, uh, we were uh, just uh, speaking to the women in police and they have a lot of issues from family issues, all that uh, they bring back to office and they don't take up uh, field jobs or assignments. So we need to really make them feel that they are not women police officers or any other woman who is in a in, a, in any industry, she shouldn't feel that I am a woman minor, I am a woman leader. Oh, forget this now, this is the past. You have to understand and feel that you are a police officer, you are a minor, 
you are a leader and that's the way with which you blaze the trail for which you have these awards so let's understand our uniqueness we are all superwomen we have too much in ourselves to change the world the world is inside us and we can change the world starting from our families let's make a difference by um, why that we would not let ourselves be suppressed or any other woman around us be suppressed and from our experience we can learn the best but how to put that experience into our mind is also our uh, our uh, way of thinking which comes in there so there are so many things that we can do and here i remember the words of michelle obama and she said that there is no limit to what we as women can accomplish let's believe in this and let's dream big let's not shy, shy away from opportunities from dialogues and then there we will be on top of the league and equal to men